Hey guys, welcome back to the Entertainment Specialist today. I've got a special episode coming up for you right now. You wanna know what it is? I'm gonna talk about New Year's resolutions. You might be wondering, Garrett, it's almost the end of January. Why would you bring up New Year's resolutions now? Why didn't you make that like at the beginning? I'll tell you why, it's actually very specific because I believe that we can talk about New Year's resolutions at any point, at any time during the year. Sometimes people feel like they can't follow through or talk about those New Year's resolutions after a certain point of time because they haven't followed through with it for one day or a week or so. Personally, there's some things that I do call New Year's resolutions and some of them I just call goals for the new year because being resolute is a very strong word. It's a very strong mindset you have to have. It's not impossible. It's just very strong for you to have. Some of those things you wanna call resolutions are actually just goals that you are trying to accomplish so that you can develop yourself to become resolute in whatever um, cause, mindset, or any other thing that you might have that you wanna do. That's the first thing. I wanted to try and explain resolutions versus goals. Understand what your resolutions are and what your goals are. And they can both be important and they should both be things that you're looking out for, but don't give up. Just because maybe you didn't exercise one day or maybe because you didn't uh, read a book for a chapter a day through the year, whatever your goal is, whatever your resolution might have been, don't give up on it. You might have to alter it a little bit, but that doesn't mean ke don't keep trying. You don't just give up. Come on. That's not the yes mindset. Also, you guys know that phrase when someone says it's a new year and therefore something is greater? So you're going to be hearing this phrase a lot. It's 2017 and blah, 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 blah. I absolutely hate it when people say that because it implies that they think that because the new year's, this new year is newer than the last one, that therefore something's gonna be better or that we are somehow, we as people are like somehow better than the people in the past or something like that. The only ones who actually can make real change in the world and make 2017 better than 2016 or 2015 and so on is our personal determination to make change better. So it's up to you, to me, to all of us collectively together. So I have a little whiteboard here where I've written many of my New Year's goals slash resolutions. So this is what I am going to try to accomplish in 2017. Body for Life. Body for Life is a workout that I did after my freshman year of college. It worked wonders for me. Strayed from it for a while and now I'm getting back on top of it. Just after three weeks, guys, I was exercising almost every day and I've had a lot better diet. And in just those three weeks, I've lost 10 pounds. When I weighed myself on the scale, I was like, oh my gosh, it was 10 pounds. I thought it was gonna be like five or something like that. Get a YouTube certificate. A YouTube certificate. Yes, you can get certified on YouTube. There's a lot of quizzes you get on, can get on there. And I already have some of the quizzes passed. So I hope to become YouTube certified this year. Windmill. I work on my b-boying a lot right now when I'm not really much of a power mover, but windmill is something I'd like to get down. So I'm gonna try and work on that. Learn 10 songs on the piano. This was actually a goal I set for myself last year as well. Didn't do too well on that, but that's okay. Keep pressing forward. You make it work. One video per week. I've kind of done that. I think maybe I've done two in one week instead of for one week. I'm not really sure, but that's the general idea. I, you should be seeing at least 52 videos this year. I guarantee you're going to see more than that. Become more spiritually nourished. I can do that in many different ways, and I just want to feel closer to my Heavenly Father and closer to the Gospel. Now here's the big goal that I want to share with you guys right now. This is the really, really big goal. I want to get 100 subscribers this year. I have a total of 21 subscribers. Thank you. I'm sure I have more people who watch these videos. So if you don't haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. I, I could really use your support. I hope that those of you who have already subscribed will share this video and invite your other friends who do have YouTube. Um, YouTube channels to subscribe to this. I want to be able to give those who subscribe to me the opportunity to also give me suggestions. What do you guys want to see on my channel? What could I talk about? I talk a lot about music. I like to talk about movies, video games, sports, food. It could be anything as long as it's entertaining in a certain perspective. Let's go for that. That's what I want to talk about with you guys. I got plenty of ideas for videos, guys, and I want you to share your ideas with me so I can 
start collaborating with you or talking about the topics. I have a lot of things I need to get ready to prepare and I want you to be a part of it, okay? 2017 is going to be amazing. Get your resolutions set. If you haven't written down all your goals and resolutions that you want for this year, it's not too late. It is not too late to start. Just because January 1st is already passed does not mean that can stop you from setting big, awesome goals. It doesn't help to just stop. You always have to have something to press you forward, even if you stumble for one day, or for one second, or for a month. Try to get back up. You have things you want to do? Get out and do them. Have that drive for your own personal yes factor! Yes factor! hope that we can get a lot more subscribers after this video. I hope that we can make some changes. I hope that I could inspire someone to actually want to follow through with their resolutions and goals or to actually set something new and something bigger and higher for themselves. And with that, I am signing out. This is Yes, Young Entertainment Specialists. Comment, subscribe, share, all the gist that you know that you need to do in order to get this around. All right, love you guys. See you soon.